hazards of making hay along the roadway. Ask me how I know. What are you doing? Set it up a notch. Oh gosh, there he goes. You can see it. Right. We're moving up, y'all. We're moving up. Down. Up. Down. Today is the day y'all, hay day. The little bit of hay that we have down anyway. Not the, not the bulk of the second cutting, but a small piece of second cutting. The guys are up here greasing the baler. Greasing the baler and then we gotta grease Rita the rake. And uh, it is, it is rough y'all, it is hot. So thankful for uh, cab tractors today. Um, we're, I don't know, upper 90s. I think it's supposed to be close to 100. So, here we go. Uh-oh. Are you having to fix something or just clean it out? No. Oh. Mm. Try to to the rake and grease it. Can't grease it now. It don't have to be hooked up. Yeah. Just out there, out there in the sunshine. That's the thing. It's so hot out there. All right. They done done all that. A ham sandwich. Okay. All right. I'm on it. All right, they have they have this under control. I knew they did, but I just wanted to make sure that everything was going okay. Um, so I'm gonna go home, make lunches, and then we're heading out. Wowser Trouser. She's a little warm out there. I already said that. I know. Um, is this the way I came? I reckon it is. <laughs> we were just talking about we we like to um we like to daydream sometimes like thinking about this huge lottery right now there's this huge lottery it's like hundreds of millions of dollars and what we would do with the money like build like a two acre shed where everything could just be together under one thing and the problem is we don't play lottery other than farming so uh anyway <laughs> That is that. All right, ham sandwiches coming up. Is it good? I don't think so. All right, T. Here we go. He was nice enough after they greased Rita to bring the tractor. Oh. <sighs> under the shed so it wouldn't be quite wouldn't be quite so hot i appreciate that it's been a while feels like it's been forever feels like
pick up trash so our cows don't have to eat a plastic bag. Hazards of uh, making hay along the roadway. For sure. on there keep it from coming off keep it from keep it from coming jumping off of here and and coming out that would be bad ask me how I know okay we just did two really small fields here and uh, now we're heading down to the river bottom do the last two films and that's it y'all not a hard day knock on wood so far so good I always follow his lead out of here because I want to make sure I go in just the right spot I'm a little protective of my rank and I don't want I don't want to lose any teeth a little dip here. Poor, poor, pitiful bean field. Oh, and I'm here running over the edge and he's probably yelling at me about it. Whoops. That's one of the fields we replanted. <laughs> and I was running, I was running all on the edge and he was looking at me like, what are you doing? What are you doing? Looks good. Looks good to me. He'll tell me if he wants it different. I don't know how come I can back my rake. I can back this rake, but I cannot back a boat trailer, y'all. I'm. <laughs> I might. I might have left that out of my uh, that last video where we went to the lake. I tried backing it up. I totally messed up, y'all. I couldn't do it. I had to let Wesley, I had to let my 13-year-old son back the boat trailer up. Anyway, I digress. All right, let's hit it. Let's hit it up a notch. I don't really know why, but this is getting a little stopped up here. A little grasshopper. It's all twisted. It's all twisted. I need a knife. Do I have a knife? No. Because I'm bad like that. Okay. It's just some that was green. It's a little green. That's it, y'all. We're done. And uh, I've hit that 3 p.m. wall. I was about to fall asleep. <laughs> I didn't bring any. I didn't bring any snacks because I ate a big lunch. I didn't. I don't, I'm not hungry, but I need something to wake me up. Anyway, okay. All right, now on 
into hauling. He's gonna be able to haul this by himself. I'm just going to help him get the trailer hooked up to the tractor. This is not very many bills. Pretty sure, pretty sure he can get it all in one load for sure, so. Okay, just had to, uh, <laughs> what is it called? Take off a triangular hitch thing. Very heavy, very heavy and uh, drag it from one tractor to the other. Yeah. Gotta keep lifting, y'all. I Gotta keep lifting. I'm still not strong enough for all the things. But I'm stronger than I was, I think. I think I am. Anyway, all right. I'm gonna go jack up the trailer for him and he's gonna be on his way. I really wanted to mow Papa's today, but I really don't think I'm going to. It's so hot. Okay, he's off. He said it's only nine bales, so nine bales. No problemo. It's actually time to think, of, think about supper. I mean, it's still a lot early, but I'm thinking about it, and I'm thinking about starting it because now I'm getting hungry. <laughs> we might just eat early tonight. I mean, I might get it ready, and I don't think it's going to take him long to get this. Okay, y'all. Um, in an effort to keep things real, 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 uh, this right here, I was going to make a recipe card and tell you all about this amazing dish that I made for supper. It was a broccoli, cube steak, cheese casserole, okay? So, um, when, I, when I went to take the picture and then start taking it out of the casserole dish, I realized that it did not have the broccoli. I. I forgot to put the broccoli in the broccoli cheese casserole. So um, we had a broccoli less broccoli cheese casserole. It was very good, but like Wesley said, mom, next time, remember the broccoli? I think it'll be even better. So that's what we'll do. And um, when I do that, I'll share it with you. Okay, so that's how, that's how my evening is going. I think the little bit of time that I've been outside today has fried what little brain cells I have left. And so I'm just, I just I'm not going outside. I'm not going outside anymore today. I'm gonna call it a day. I'm gonna go chill out and try to find a movie or something, I don't know, John Wayne, something. And um, see what tomorrow holds. <laughs> so there you go. Hope that makes somebody feel better if you've done something recently that was just like, what? Yeah, you're not alone. I'm with you. Okay, we worked hard. It's time to play hard. New tube. We'll see. I think it's going to beat them to death. <laughs> I think it's gonna beat y'all to death. Being on your belly, you won't be able to sit on your back. You won't be able to sit in this one. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> All right. Easy peasy. That's all fish? All those little dots? Those fish, but you can't make them bite. <laughs> but you can't make them bite. I want a fish finder that finds fish that bites. He wants a fish, <laughs> fish finder that finds fish that bites. We just They just put this in the other day. 
It tells the depth of the water. How deep is it? Is that this 26, 27? Yeah. Okay. And it tells the temperature. The temper the water is 90 degrees. Yeah. Well, I don't totally doubt it. I got in in tubes. And it was very warm on my feet, slapping the water the whole time. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's just a hunt. Oh. I was like, uh, if that's all fish, then we just need no, to go home and get our rods. Oh, well, that these confused me. Oh, okay. Alrighty. It's, it's looking at it. So it's looking at it like this, I think. So it's looking down, and that's what it sees. Is that little, little, little. Oh, okay. And so you're looking at it from the side. Okay, hey. Nothing. Is, is there any fish here? It looks fishy. It just looks fishy. Okay, trip number two in the books. Another fun morning. Lawrence was correct. He said, we need to get out there early before the rest of the crowd. He said, they're going to start rolling in at 10 o'clock. We got out here at what, 8.30? Well, I don't know. I don't know. Eight. It's now 10, 11, and they are rolling in. <laughs> Thick as thieves. So, that was good. Got the tube. Got to ride around and look at pretty houses. Found some fish. So we'll come back. We're going to go fishing. Found some fish. Going to come back and go fishing, but not today. Because it's 100 degrees. It's going to be 100 degrees. We're going we're gonna to get out here by daylight. Go fishing. Daylight. Okay. By 8.30. Go to the house. Oh, okay. <laughs> we think we found a honey hole. He thinks he found a honey hole. Deep, dark, cool. If anybody knows where you buy a fish finder that finds fish to bite, let me know. If anybody knows where you can buy a fish finder that finds fish, not just finds fish, but finds fish that bite, let us know. I have a feeling if that existed, they would definitely be multi-millionaires. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all ain't got the tube tied tight enough to get out. Alright, we're going to stop up here oh. and try to get some ice cream anyway. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. more than 29 <laughs> I think, it's blowing up. It's blowing I think we'd up. pick your boat up if we was going there. The tube would pick the boat up? Oh yeah, the boat would be flying around in there. They ain't even open. Oh, here they are. Also want to give a shout out to some viewers that we met when we were coming out. They were going in. Uh, and let's see, it was Lauren. Pretty sure it was Lauren Holt and her daughter. I know I'm gonna get it wrong. Joseph Ann? I think it was Joseph Ann. Josephine? Joseph Ann. It was something between Joseph and Anyway, it was a beautiful name. I'm sorry, I just butchered it. Uh, yeah, so that was fun. It was fun. Yay. I hope y'all, if you're watching this, I hope y'all had a great day at the lake. This will obviously air after such a time. Anyway, all right. You wanna go find some ice cream? It, it is warming up. It feels great when you're out there as soon as you stop. The heat and the humidity are like. <sighs> All right. Wesley remembered it was Josie Ann. I knew it was not. It was Josie Ann. I love that name. It's beautiful. Well, she was a beautiful girl. So, anyway, okay, here we go. Okay, this was a good idea. We all got like two different scapes. What'd you get, Wes? Cotton candy and strawberry. Cotton candy and strawberry. Cotton candy and play doh. Play doh, y'all. Who ever heard of such? Play-Doh ice cream, banana pudding, butter pecan, and a double scoop of butter pecan that's almost gone. <laughs> okay, um, so we're having a <clears throat> we're having a pretty relaxing day. Not gonna lie, we got home from the lake and ice cream. I even uh, floated in the pool for about an hour. That makes two hours this whole summer that I've been in our pool. <laughs> and um, uh, right now, uh, I really need to get out there and make sure everything's okay. Uh, Lawrence is ha has just gone over with Wesley and the neighbor, uh, <laughs> our friend David, 
to Papa's basement to get this inversion board thingamajiggy. This thing that you like turn upside down on that Papa used to use and have. Uh, his back has been killing him and he thinks this is going to help him. And so I guess it is, oh gosh, there he goes. You can see it right there. Oh, <laughs> there he goes. Gosh, he's, um, he's going to see if it will help, help his back. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, rubbing. Do you pass out of it? Just to hang till you pass out? No, I don't think that's right. Hmm. I wasn't counting. I wasn't counting fast enough. I didn't know that that was my job too. Okay, water break. Let's go down find him a He's gonna go lay down. Watch. <laughs> How's that, buddy? Oh, 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 I got hung, oh, I got hung up there. All right, y'all, it has been a good day. Tea time, tea for Lawrence, uh, supper time. It's a leftover kind of night. We got stuffed peppers left over from several days ago, but they're still good. Uh, so yeah, today, Oh, Austin's riding Hank. Okay, this is what we're doing, evidently. She just, uh, if she can jump on a bareback, she's gone. She, let me tell you, this is cute. It's, it's very, it's very hot. Well, it says 91, it was 99, so it's coming down. She's been um, watching, looking at the weather radar or weather, weather channel app or whatever um, to see like, the the temperature and she said mom at like eight o'clock it's supposed to be 81 i'm like yeah well the humidity is still 110 percent but uh anyway she can't stand it she said today i'm so ready for it to be fall i said me too and then i started thinking y'all we still have to get through august august is usually the worst around here i don't even want to think about it but um yeah we've had a good day a pretty lazy day what i call a lazy day I mean, we didn't sleep in because we don't sleep in with dogs. We don't get to sleep in. But um, between going to the lake and then coming home and hanging out in the pool a little bit and just not doing any work. No work. I did no work today. It was very hard because I had some stuff I could do. And part of me felt like I should do. But, um, yeah. It was nice. It was nice to take a little break. So... Uh, I would call this a, <laughs> I was thinking about this because Lawrence rarely ever leaves the farm. It's just hard. It's hard. We've talked about this before, but anyway, I would kind of consider three hours away at the lake a staycation. We had a staycation. That's what we did. Three hour staycation. Okay. All right, babe. Supper's ready. 
it was hot. It needed a cool. Oh, the, the teeter-totter thing. So, he hung on it for like 30 seconds and he said his back stopped hurting. <laughs> so, hey, if that's all it takes. I guess we have a new addition to the porch because the porch needed something else on it. But at least it's not a mattress. It's not a bed frame. And it's not a dresser. We're moving up, y'all. We're moving up. Down, up, down. I thought I heard somebody. Hello. <laughs> Who's outside my dirty kitchen window? Whoa, what's the matter, Hanky? <laughs>